Good morning. Welcome to worship on this beautiful Pentecost Sunday morning. We are glad you are here this morning. You noticed that I was wearing a mask. I was doing that because we are practicing best practices here in the sanctuary as we begin to worship for the first time in person for the first time in a long time. We are encouraging all those who are worshiping with us in person to wear a mask and to keep that six foot distance apart from one another. The announcements this morning are for those who are here worshiping in the sanctuary with us and also those of you who continue to worship with us via live stream. We make both of those opportunities available for you. We'd like to call your attention to a couple things this morning uh, during our announcements. Tuesday, we have two Bible studies at 1030 with Dr. Tim Womack via live stream and Zoom. You can find that information on our website and Facebook page. And on Tuesday night at 7.30, I lead a study. We are actually starting a book by Henry Nowen called Following Jesus. That is also available via Zoom. You can find that information on our website and Facebook as well. On Wednesday, we are offering at 5 o'clock a drive-by blessing and communion fellowship cup pickup. If you're not able to worship with us in the sanctuary for the first Sunday of June, we invite you to come and to drive through the Circle Drive at the Center for Christian Life, pick up one of the fellowship cups, and receive a blessing from one of your pastors. We're glad to see you if this is a, a possibility for you. There are a lot of announcements as we begin to think about how we worship together in person and how we can keep those best practices. For those of you who are contemplating when you will join us, we remind you that we have three services, 8.30, 9.45 and 11 a.m. All of these services are separated by 30 minutes where we can clean the sanctuary and prepare for the next congregation. If you would like to attend one of those services, please contact the church and let us know so we can make sure that we have enough space for everyone who desires to worship in person with us. For now, let us turn our hearts and minds to God and worship. Let us worship God. <laughs> 